Hey, what's going on guys, Evan from Model 3D, and in today's video I'm going to be doing a short little unboxing of the new Wanhao Duplicator 7. This is the newest printer by Wanhao, it's actually a DLP or a DLU printer, meaning that it uses UV curable resin and has a high resolution 2K LCD screen on the top with a UV LED backlight. This is actually a pre-sale version, um, I purchased this directly through Wanhao, it was £415 including shipping to the UK. This is an absolute bargain when you compare it to other DLP um, or SLA printers like the Formlabs, um, they're in the thousands, $3,000, that kind of stuff. So this is a really, really low kind of price point. As for what you get in the box, as you can see it comes with the power cable, um, you've got the printer here, it's actually a lot smaller than I expected, it's got a 110 by 70 by 200 millimeter build volume, which for a DLP printer or an SLA printer is actually a really really good size. The whole machine is solid, powder coated sheet metal, it has a really nice weight to it, it feels solid, it feels great. As for the packaging, it really wasn't that well packaged. Um, this top metal housing um, had no foam between the bottom section, so in transit it wobbled around, it banged against the bottom and ended up leaving um, scratches and kind of taking off some of the powder coating on the edges. Um, this is kind of disappointing but it's kind of expected at the same time with a um, beta unit or a pre-sale unit kind of thing, where they're still flushing out the problems and trying to find out the best way to kind of package stuff. The accessories box was just tie wrapped to the build plate. Um, it didn't wobble, it didn't move, so that's great. It comes with everything you need to get going. For example, the power cable, of course, um, a small sample of resin, just enough to get a few small sample prints out, um, some gloves to keep that sticky resin off your hands, a little kind of wash pot, and a bag of tools like a scraper, um, the HDMI cables, the USB cables, all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to be posting a lot more videos on this as I set it up, as I get my first prints, all that kind of stuff. So if you're interested in seeing that, make sure to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next video.